chair of the library trustees and um, on behalf of the library trustees and the friends of the library and our library director Christine Finnegan I would like to welcome you all to this fantastic event tonight we are just so thrilled um, with the honor that Chris is about to receive and I'm just really delighted with it um, this award is from the New Hampshire Library Trustees Association and the president of that association, Adele Knight, is with us tonight and I'm going to turn things over to her right now. Adele. Marsha Burstead, back from all, and Connie Kerwin. <laughs> it's nice to see such a great turnout, and I couldn't believe uh, having this wonderful music to begin with. And I happened to notice that cake, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that had the picture of Chris with a snake. That was the very last picture in the book that they sent with the nomination letter. And I thought, oh my gosh. If anybody can do that, they can do anything. <laughs> and I just, I have some notes here. I would just, it's so, Chris has done so much that I just, I said, I can't remember it all. So I'm just going to read a few notes if you don't mind. Um, just this is what the, li the library trustees said about Chris. With limited hours, a small budget, and a small library, Chris's leadership made a significant contribution to the town of Nelson. She has made the library the center of the community. Chris has been library director here for 20 years. There is not time or space to cover every year and her every contribution. That's how much she has done. In addition to working in Nelson, Chris still works four hours a week in the Harrisville Library as the children's librarian. And if I remember from reading the nomination letter, I believe she was librarian there for seven years or something like that to begin with. So, and she's still there, that's wonderful. Chris worked diligently with the trustees making the case for a new library. She wrote a grant application and received $18,000 towards the new library. She was an integral member of the team that designed the, new, designed the new library. She did the research, paperwork, and everything to qualify for the old library to be on the New Hampshire Register of Historic Places. Since Chris has been here, 20 years, but attendance and circulation has increased appreciably. According to the uh, 2010 State Library Statistics, the Nelson Library had more patron visits and a higher circulation than any other library of its size. <laughs> I thought that was very commendable. Um, with volunteers, Chris made available computer-related services, even undertaking the design and maintenance of the website for the town of Nelson. Um, I believe that uh, won an award from the New Hampshire Magazine this yeah. past year. The website is so nice. And there was a picture of it in, in the uh, nomination letter booklet. Chris got a two-year grant from the Gates Foundation in the amount of $5,200 to buy new computers and printers and support services. I mean, to have a librarian that only does librarian work but writes grants, that's pretty outstanding. That's very nice. Chris has also received recommendation for Librarian of the Year from the Friends of the Library President, the Principal of the Nelson School, and the Harrisville Library Director. And there were also there were letters that came along from different people in town. So we, everyone is just so proud of you, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just so happy if you come up here, please. I'll give you this award. <laughs> Thank you. 
and play music for, for my events and, and um, it's just it's just a really great thing. And also, you know, the New Hampshire State Library is very supportive too. Um, so thank you everyone. Thank you to the library trustees. Thank you, library trustees, for this award. And um, it's it's very meaningful. And um, thank you to my whole community. Thank you.